Welcome to this video where we will show an introduction to the Pelican wireless integration into the Dingo stack that has been done in partnership with the Sys Converge in Canada. The purpose of the Pelican wireless integration is to take the thermostats and power outputs accessed via the Pelican climate control API and virtualize them as BACnet devices. In our Dingo manager, we begin by enabling the Pelican integration in the peripheral setup and the backnet setup. We then add the URL that points to the Pelican Climate Control API. My URL has been provided by Sysconverge in Canada and contains my specific credentials. We then open the Pelican Wireless Discovery tool and click the button that will scan for thermostats and power outputs and auto-configure these as BACnet devices. When this is completed, then we can go to the BACnet setup and find the auto-configured BACnet device and read the different BACnet objects. For example, the current temperature, CO2 level, and we see the fan is set to auto. The Dingo Stack peripheral setup will pull the Pelican Climate Control API for data every two minutes by default. This can, however, be adjusted if needed. The auto configuration also produces trend logs, and their logging properties can also be adjusted if needed. If we use a BACnet Explorer, for example, Yabe, then we see that it discovers our new BACnet device and we can read the different thermostat properties and also the trend log objects. We can also write values back to the Pelican Climate Control API via the BACnet objects. Here in my browser, I am reading a fan property directly from the Pelican Climate Control API, and we see that it is configured to auto. In Yabe, we can read the same property as a BACnet object, and we see that its present value reads 1, which means it is on auto. In a second browser window, I'm going to use our test client which is part of our Dingo stack, to subscribe to change of values on the BACnet object representing the fan. If I would change the fan from auto to on by changing the present value from one to two, then we see the value changes in the test client. And if we read the value again in the Pelican API, then we see that it has also changed. So to summarize, we have developed in partnership with SysConverge in Canada an auto-configured bi-directional Pelican 2 BACnet integration into our Dingo stack. If potential clients need help with building analytics and solution integration in Canada, then contact SysConverge. Thank you for watching.